A96 drooling review costs £5 million. Let's not forget another election pledge here. This was pledged in the summer of 2021 by the SNP to duel the A96 between Aberdeen and Inverness. This was supposed to be completed by 2030. However, as soon as they jumped into bed with the Greens, it was put under what they called review or climate review, if you listen to the Scottish Greens. And as we know now, it's been delayed once again. And just since June this year, the cost had already hit up to June £3.8 million just in reviewing the project. Since June up to now, it's gone up a further £1.2 million, costing taxpayers £5 million just to look at a road and decide whether it can be done or not. Scottish Tory Liam Kerr said uh, residents are rightly furious at the ludicrous sums of money which have been spent on the A96 corridor review. But don't worry, the SNP have got another spin on it. They say it's not an unreasonable figure given the length and complexity of the corridor subject to the review and the extent of the work being carried out to complete it. It's perfectly simple. Jewel the road. If this was anywhere else, it would have been done years ago. And as for that climate rubbish on the climate review, as they call it, don't give me that rubbish. You're not telling me that between Aberdeen and Inverness, you've got huge amounts of air pollution, because that's bollocks, as anybody knows, who's driven up there. You couldn't ask for a much more rural setting than what you've got up there. So don't tell me that it's air pollution, because that is absolute rubbish. This is just sheer incompetence. They're scared of displeasing their green bosses once again.